Hi, this is Sash here. Just finished, just sort of more or less got through the refeeding of my, I went through eight, probably eight and a half days water fasting. And it was quite an amazing experience. Well, I mean, not most of it. Most of it was pretty st straightforward. The first six days, I just felt like I was cruising, um, very focused, really enjoying it, enjoying the sun, enjoying some of the rest. What I did notice was one of the biggest things was that it was very, very hard to get to sleep. And uh, this is a common symptom, but it's, that's exactly what it is. It's a symptom and it's a symptom of way too much conscious thinking coming up from the detox process and a lot of hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of thoughts. And I was getting to bed like sometimes one, two, even three o'clock when I was trying to get to bed at like 10. So it was fairly restless. So yeah, it was only on the seventh day the seventh night that I really had a breakthrough. I was, I got really frustrated and then I just went into my room and I just lay there and I prayed and I prayed and I prayed and I prayed for nothing more than to feel love and be loving no matter what. And for me at that time, no matter what was no matter what my body was feeling. And I mean, that's one of the biggest things on this, um, with this existence that all these emotions and all these feelings and belief systems are all very very based on the body so once it's in so many scriptures once you free yourself from the body or free your mind from the body you start to experience freedom and love so i just prayed for it and prayed for it and prayed for it and eventually it came and i fell asleep so well and i had one of the best sleeps i've had in a long time and more than anything I haven't been able to dream or have positive dreams in a long time feels like over a year and I had this fantastic set of dreams it was good one of them was I was finishing my book and it was pu published and I was holding it and yeah just real positive manifestation dreams and I've had good dreams ever since so that was one of the biggest things that I actually had a reprogramming, um, reprogramming of the subconscious mind so now that um, I'm starting to experience some pleasant dreams at night and also sleep better. So that, that was really good. Um, other than that, my nose has cleared up great. On the physical side, my nose has cleared up great. I feel like my body is detoxed a lot. Um, yeah, feeling really healthy. Skin feels really healthy. I'll just give you a quick look at the body. So, as far as physical concepts, I think I dropped from about 136 pounds to 124, so 12 pounds loss. And now I'm back up to 130 in like three days. I've put on half of it back, which is great because that was a completely low weight for me. I think I was on the border, I'm pretty sure I was on the border of starvation there and I could start to feel it, so that's why I started eating and didn't go for the 10 days. Yeah, I, I feel like I really know my body well now and I know when it's at its end with with fat stores and when, I've, when I can actually go longer. Um, it was a little bit challenging having a baby and wife with me because you obviously have to spend your attention and time with them too and you can't just go into deep focus and meditation. Next time I do this, I'd want to do it during the Vipassana session where I have no movement and just meditate the whole time. 10 days in silence with, uh, with a fast would be amazing. Um, other than that, um, we bought a juicer, so looking to get into some great juices in the next couple of days. And then continuing our raw food tour and I'll post some more videos to, to some of the restaurants I go to. Okay, thanks, bye.